एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल पिनिकल ऑफ इंग्लिश इन टूडेज क्लास वी लर्न अबाउट द एडवेंचर्स ऑफ टोटो चैप्टर नंबर टू फ्रॉम द बुक मोमेंट्स ऑफ सी बी एस ई क्लास नाइन्थ इंग्लिश दिस स्टोरी इज रिटर्न बाई रस्किन बॉन्ड नाउ लेट सी about author Ruskin Bond was born on 19 May 1934 in Punjab He spent his childhood in Gujarat and Shimla He has done his schooling in Bishop Cotton School Shimla and graduated in 1950 His famous works are The Room on the Roof where he was 17 years old and published when he was 21 years old his another book was a flight of pigeons his achievements are sahitya academy award in 1992 padma shri in 1999 and padma bhushan in 2014 the theme of the story of adventures of toto is the story is based on experiences of people who keep animals as pets the theme thus deals with the outcome of the interaction between humans and animals in this story we can find the interaction between grandfather a human and other animals like toto the monkey and nana the donkey it shows that not all animals can adapt themselves to human way of life it requires a great deal of patience and skill to train animals to require non destructive behavior now the main character of the story is grandfather he was a true lover of animals he even bought a monkey namely toto from a tonga driver for rupees 5 the tonga driver used to keep the monkey tied on the feeding trough grandfather loved animals so he decided to keep this toto monkey in his zoo so he had his own private zoo so he decided to keep and add this toto to his zoo grandfather loved animals too much but main thing is that grandmother raskin's grandmother did not like animals she was not liking animals she was hating animals too much now next toto a pretty monkey his fingers were quick and he used his tail as a third hand he used his hand to hang from one branch to another branch of a tree his presence was kept secret from his grandmother as she did not like animals toto was a very naughty animal one day he disturbed everything in the room therefore grandmother grandfather decided to transfer him to a big cage where other animals were living grandfather was a retired person so he had to collect his pension to saharanpur grandfather was to collect his pension in saharanpur he decided to take toto along with him toto was kept in a big canvas bag so that he could not escape 
he popped his head out of the bag which resulted in payment of 3 rupees to the railway ticket collector because the ticket collector found toto monkey out of the canvas bag and he was recognize a dog but not real toto that monkey and that's why he took a charge of 3 rupees to journey to go from one place to another place now let's see toto was kept in a zoo prahini's private zoo and beside this toto there was nana a donkey was there so when toto was finally accepted in the house he was given a comfortable home in the stable but he kept troubling nana a family donkey he was disturbing this donkey a lot but later on toto and nana never became friends because he was disturbing donkey this nana too much treat of the toto toto as we know was a very naughty monkey so one day he had bathed with warm water in winter evening a large kettle uh, left on fire with water to boil for tea he checked that warm water he kept his finger in the boiled water and entered the kettle for bath but later on grandmother came on time and saved him even toto did not like when somebody laughed at him when somebody laughed at him he felt hurt he did not like it when somebody was laughing at him later on grandfather had a final decision and that decision was that the toto was not or could not be a member of the house a member of the private zoo so soon grandfather decided that toto was not the type of pet to be kept in the house he found the tonga driver and sold to him for 3 rupees only this is what the final story of the chapter 2 adventures of toto written by raskin bond now moral of the story is grandfather was a kind hearted person he was an animal lover by choice he had his own private zoo in the house he kept bringing home new animals that he liked he was a fully determined person he had a lot of patience and took all things positively when he brought toto he felt satisfied he wanted to keep toto with other animals but toto he kept disturbing other animals yet grandfather transferred him frequently from one place to another place in order to make toto adjust with the other animals he was a man of strong mind and body his taste made him a naturalist 
he enjoyed his life in the life of nature he treated his pet animals and his family members moreover there are some animals like monkeys cannot be kept in our homes as pet animals for their particular traits but we must give them a chance to live with us because they need our love and compassion so here we are ending our story if you have liked my video please don't forget to subscribe click button on bell for the notification and like icon thank you thank you so much